Hello everybody, sorry for the long wait, but here is episode 10 of the series, and what we're building today, well, we're building the town hall. Now, I know that this is really far away from the rest of the town, but we need to start moving into other islands, because there's loads of space over here for later builds. So, we've got this massive space here, and we're going to be building a massive house in this, you could say. Uh, but... This will be in the form of a time lapse because we're taking a bit of every single one of these houses to get into this town hall. So, for example, we'll have the main section being the dirt, nether rack, and diamond. Uh, another section being the sponge, diorite, and magma, that sort of thing. So, we're gonna make sure that we put a lot of effort into this so I think that it might be time to start the time lapse let's go
Uh, the outside is pretty much done. I've worked on putting a few ladders around so we can get between certain floors. But look, it looks uh, like a mess. It does, it looks like a mess. But that's what I like about it. It's a chaotic mess, which is really, really cool and really, really fun. I'm just going to put the last pieces of glass in because we need some windows in there. And then I think we'll have a. I'll show you uh, what's inside. Uh, so if we go in the front door, which doesn't exist yet, you can see we've got a ladder up there. So we'll go up here first, because this takes us in to the diorite room. Well, 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 actually there's no diorite, there's only the sponge and the magma. Uh, but if over here we have the glass, and if we go up here, we will find pumpkin house, uh, where we have where duke boxes as the floor. Um, now, uh, well, also we use spruce instead. Um, if we go along here, you find yourself in a room of carpets, and yeah, it's not very well. well you don't want to fall down that one, uh, otherwise you'll land back on the bottom floor. Now, if we go up here, we're into uh, the beehive room. Now I can't remember what was on the floor for this. Um, but I've just gone with spruce because it looks quite nice. And uh, if we go over into here, here we have the no full blocks room, and through here we have the trapdoors room, and that is all the rooms. Now the hardest thing is getting yourself out down. Actually, it's pretty easy, but finding the ladder down is hard. Now this one I cannot remember where it was. I think it was here. Yes, there we go. So yeah, there's loads of different um, floors, and that's what I really like about it. There's another that the, I could make another way up, but I don't want to. I think this is really cool. It's a sort of hidden ways to get up quite often. And now we've got to do the interior. So I'll be right back once I've finished the. Interior. Well, the interior is finished, um, but I realised there was one room I hadn't actually connected to the whole thing, and that was the uh, the ancient debris and purple room. So we'll just have a look around that. So you can look at any of the furniture I've put down while we go over there. So look, got some nice desks, etc. Now that is where the purple, well, the purple room is. Well, I'm calling it the purple room because that's easier to remember by. But that's not how we're going to get there. We're going to go the long way. Um, so we'll just go out here. Nice office. Um, to go up here. Uh, office. And then go down here. It's the treasury. So there you have it, guys. Um, yeah, how do I get out? There we go. Uh, there you have it, guys. Um, that is the series. Well, that is the first part of the series complete. We've done ten builds, and I think we can give ourselves a pat on the back for that. That was amazing. It That finishes this area off. We're going to probably, in the future, do the series again. We're going to continue building some more houses, but to, for the moment, I'm going to have a break, because this has taken a while. And I'm a bit sick of this, to be honest. But it is fun. But this build in particular, gosh, it took a while. So thank you, everyone, uh, very much for watching and, and keeping track through the series. And thank you, everyone who has suggested blocks to use. You're a great help. And I guess I will see you in my next video. Or when I start a new series. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.